Hola amigos! I am here to do a different video for you guys. It is a DIY and I've been wanting to do this. This is going to be uh, me depotting a majority of my affordable drugstore lipsticks and putting them into a view set little thing. So this is the B4 and we're going to make it so that it is like so. So I bought two of these. I'll go ahead and link them down below. They were about $16 each and each fits about 24 lipsticks. So that's pretty cool. Alrighty. Well, the reason why I did this was because I just had no space for lipstick. So I wanted to go ahead and make sure that everything was, you know, in a cute little thing like so. And especially it makes it pretty easy when you're traveling because you can just grab this and you can have all the other colors instead of all these tubes of lipsticks. Alrighty, so uh, let's go ahead and get started. First thing you need, view set, little organizer, a spatula, double edged. Have some paper towels because you need to clean up in between. You need a notebook as well as a pen so you can write down the names of the lipsticks. I've seen people do the labeling on the bottom portion, but I feel like that's too much. So what I do is I go went ahead and labeled it in a type of systematic way. So it's, um, let me see if I can show you guys. Okay, so I did an A, B, C, and a 1 through 8, and that's how I'm labeling it. So this would be A1, B2, kind of thing, you know what I'm saying, if you can get that from there. And then last but not least, you need lipstick. So here I have my e.l.f., NYC's, and Wet n Wild. So I have here 24 lipsticks. Let's get started. <laughs> So I just got done. So this is what it looks like afterwards. Here's that. I have two of them that I can go ahead and stack. So all together, this is 48 lipsticks stacked. So super cool. Usually when I'm done, I can tell that my hands are just crazy. And then I also have a crazy amount of Q-tips and paper, um, paper napkins. And then I have all my empty things here that I'm going to go ahead and put in my trash. But that pretty much wraps it up. I hope this was somewhat informative. I did forget to do on my to-do or on my need, like things you need, Q-tips. Q-tips are number one. I use about probably 10 or 15 as I'm going through everything. So yeah. All right, well, I hope you guys liked this video. If you guys did, go and give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos by me, click that red subscribe button. It would totally make my day, and I will see you guys later. Bye!